Alrighty, so you may be thinking to yourself, well, you taught us, Mr. Bebo, about the intro to printmaking. We know how to do it. We know where to start. I just want to make my design. I want to bump and get right into it. And I get you, you're excited, but there's something you got to know first. Um, and that's how to flip designs and text in Microsoft Word. And you're like, Mr. Bebo, what are you talking about? Flipping designs and text? Like, why do I have to flip stuff? Well, you got to remember in printmaking, when we make a print, everything has to be reversed. And you're like, wait, so you're Mr. Bebo, what do you mean? Well, have you ever looked at a rubber stamp before? Um, as you can see, every rubber stamp, if you look at it, Look closely, everything is reversed. Do you see the T there is reversed, the O and the P? And it's not just reversed in the word, like it says pot, but the letters are reversed too. So you have to reverse everything. That's something that you gotta know right away when you're printing. And it kind of gets complicated, but that's why technology is nice because it helps us to make things easier. So. Um, I'm going to show you how to reverse stuff. And now I'm going to show you some example first of what it looks like to reverse something. So you get to see here, as you can tell, this person who made this love print, everything is reversed. The L, the O, the V, and the E. Everything's flipped. Um, same with the moo print here. So on their print here, moo becomes oom, um, <laughs> which is kind of weird, but that's how you have to do the design so that when you print it, you put it on there, you ink it up, that the design is all ready to go. So I want to show you an example here. Um, I have picked out a Batman symbol so I can show you. Let's scoot over here. So I got this already copied on my Microsoft Word. Um, so I'm going to show you how to flip this because it'd be super hard to try to redraw this and flip it. Um, and that's why Microsoft Word helps us. So here's what we're gonna do. First off, I'm gonna zoom in here. I'm gonna right click on my format picture. Okay, so I'm gonna go up and let's go over here and you'll notice something. You have all these different things, fill, line, shadow, glow, um, and soft edges, reflection, 3D format, and this is what we want right here, 3D rotation. It sounds super fancy, but um, what it allows you to do is flip an image either on the X axis or Y axis. And hopefully you know from math what the X and Y axis is. We'll be working on the X axis. And nice enough, you get to see the little images that show you how it's gonna be flipped. Um, so we have to flip at 180 degrees because we want it flipped totally all the way. Um, but we don't want it flipped 360 because I'll just flip it back to the same place. So I'm gonna type in here 180 and then I'll hit enter, okay? So we are going to zoom out here, and you'll notice, ta-da, it's backwards. And I'm like, bingo. So now you can take this, you can print it out, you can use it for your design. So let's say though, you want to do some custom text. And you're like, hmm, that's cool, I like that logo, but I'm, I want to draw my own thing, Mr. B. I don't want to like use some logo or whatever. But I kind of, I don't feel confident about doing the lettering backwards. I think that's a little bit tough, and I want to try out my own font. You can do that in Microsoft Word too. So let me delete this. Here's what you need to do though. You can't just type in la la la, you can't type in text then make it backwards. It doesn't work that way. In Microsoft Word, you have to put in a text box first. So we're gonna do that. Let's go up here to insert and we're gonna insert a text box right here. So we're gonna insert that text box. I'll put it right there. I'll put in my text. Um, let's say I like penguins. Okay, so we got I like penguins. Let me change the font here because what's the point of doing that if we can't change the font and the font size and everything? So I'm going to do that. Let's do this. Change here. And then we got it right there. So here's what we need to do. And my computer's getting slow. We have the text box, I got everything I wanted. Here is the key. You cannot have the text clicked on. You have to have the text box clicked on. So I gotta see right here, you see these four arrows. You gotta click on the text box, same thing. You right click, format shape. So it's gonna say shape because the text box is kind of a shape in Microsoft Word. So I'm gonna hit format shape 
and same thing pops up here. So let's zoom in. We got 3D rotation, we are already on it. And uh, we know from the last one that we have to do 180 degrees, hit enter, and bingo, check that out. Flips it for you, incredible, right? Amazing. Then you can change the size a little bit more if you want to, adjust stuff. Um, that's basically how you create designs. Uh, hopefully you'll get some good ideas for your new design and printmaking.